Sound Design. So an important step of verifying that my audio analyzer is set up and ready to go, even though I've set it up at home, when I'm actually opening it up in the field, I'm still gonna verify that all of the IO is correct in my audio analyzer. So I've got Smart Version 8 open here. So as soon as I get it open, I'll just hit Option A to open up the IO config. I'll check, let's see, correct input device, correct output device, yes, great. Uh, sample rate is where I expect it to be. Number of inputs are what I expect them to be. The friendly names are correct. Reference, measurement microphone. My microphone correction curves are selected correctly. Great, so I'll head over to the measurement config tab. And here, um, I'll just double check that the correct reference channel and measurement channel are selected. because so I don't want these to be backwards. Uh, here's my measurement mic, here's my reference mic. I'll go through all of these if I have more than one um, measurement microphone coming in or more than one device over te under test. And then the last thing is my output, my um, signal generator. Option N opens up signal generator settings. And the main thing here is that I'll just look kind of briefly at everything, but I just want to make sure that I have the right output device selected here in channel, and I should be good to go. So. That's just a quick verification of my IO settings in Smart, and in the next video, I'll look at SatLive. Sound Design. Live.